from being a fragile boy who never knew his father to being the governor of his state, Alaska, to becoming the 42nd president of the most powerful country on earth, the United States. Bill Clinton definitely has some secrets that made him hugely successful. But wait, why are some people very successful in life when most other people fail? It must be because successful people know, think and do certain things which other people don't. Welcome to the Secrets of Success and don't forget to subscribe if you are new here. In this video, we bring to you Bill Clinton's 7 Secrets of Success. By secrets, we mean what he knows, thinks and does that makes him very successful. Secret number 1. Bill Clinton didn't allow his background to dictate his future. Just before he was born at Julia Chester Hospital in 1946, Clinton's father died in an auto crash, leaving the young boy fatherless. Not just that, Bill Clinton's mother got married four years after his dad died to an abusive man who maltreated Clinton and his mother. For so many young people in the world, having no father is enough reason to give up on life. We are in a generation of excuse making. Most people want to look for reasons why they are not successful and the easiest way to look is their background. I have no father. I have no mother. My stepfather maltreated me. The list is endless. Listen young people, your background doesn't determine your future except you allow it to. You have strength and the willpower to overcome anything if only you stay focused and be determined. Secret number 2. Bill Clinton was in haste with life As a young boy, Bill Clinton got to know that his father died at the age of 29. Hence, the young boy became worried about the possibility of himself dying as early as 29. My father died at 29. What if I died at 29 too? The young Clinton always worried. However, instead of him to allow these worries to weigh him down, young Clinton decided to rush through life and get things done as fast as possible. That's why he could dream big and pursue big dreams with his life early in life. That's why he could become a lecturer of law at age 25, a governor at 32 and the United States president at 47. Young people, you don't have to think about death before you dream big or be in a hurry. We are living in an age where people waste too much time on entertainment and pleasure. If you wake up every day to remind yourself how short life is, you'll probably spend less time on social media and TV. You'll probably slap yourself a few times for not reading good books. <laughs> Your time is short. Be in a hurry. Secret number 3. Bill Clinton was a crazy reader. In certain two years, Clinton read about 300 books. Because of great knowledge he acquired from reading good books, Clinton always knew far more than his age mates and as you might know, people worship and trust wiser people. Hence, Clinton could be trusted with political powers even at his 20s. Compare that to our world today. An average young person today don't face their book because of Facebook. They would rather buy big TV than to have a small library. How can we expect more people to be successful in our generation when most people don't regard knowledge? Listen young people, for you to join the rank of the top 5% of the rich and successful people of the world, you must know hundreds of things the 95% of the world's population don't know. Make your research about the most successful people in any field of human endeavor and one thing will be clear. They all know thousands of things most other people in their fields don't know. Think of Barack Obama, Bill Gates, Albert Einstein, Oprah Winfrey and others. They are all from different fields of life but one thing unites them. They are all readers and seekers of knowledge. What you read determines what you become. Spend less time on social media, spend more time in the library. Secret number 4. Bill Clinton started his career early Most people of the world know Bill Clinton as the former president of the United States. Some people know that he was once the governor of Alaska. By the way, 
do you know that he was the second youngest governor of Alaska after John Selden Rene? What you may not know is that Bill Clinton actually started his political career as a young boy in high school at the Hot Springs High School where he was a student leader. What is the lesson for the young people here? Don't wait. Whatever you want to do with your life, start as early as you can. Starting early is advantageous because you can make enough mistakes and learn from them as fast as possible. Go out and start pursuing your dreams today. Young age shouldn't be wasted on pleasure, partying and entertainment. Strong bones are designed for life's marathon. Young people, start now. Secret number 5. If you live long enough, you'll make mistakes. But if you learn from them, you'll be a better person. Bill Clinton What does it take to achieve greatness in life? The ability to take massive actions. What does it take to take massive actions? Right perspectives about mistakes. Most young people in our world today are afraid of stepping out. They hate their job, but they are afraid of starting their dreamed business. They are young and have great willpower, but they are afraid of making mistakes. For Clinton to achieve so much with his life, he needed to overcome the fear of failure. Success in life is always reserved for people who can dare life, people who can fall multiple times and stand up again. Young people, go out and pursue your dreams. You'll make mistakes and fail, and that's fine. As long as you don't give up, you'll succeed. Secret number 6. We all do better when we work together. Bill Clinton how far do you think Clinton could have gone if he was a lone ranger? Just as far as most people. For you to succeed in life, you must be able to build a team and work with other people. Life is like a war. It's tough, tough and tough. No matter what you want to do with your life, be it business, politics, invention or sport, you must be able to build a team and work with others. If you want to be successful in life, you must know how to build a team and work with other people. Secret number 7 Let us all take more responsibility not only for ourselves and our families but for our communities and our country. Bill Clinton So many people have alleged millennials are being lazy and having entitlement mentality. If you are a millennial, you may not want to believe that but here is it. How often do you think someone owes you something? How often do you think that your life depends on the government or your parents? How often do you blame other people for your failure or poverty? The more responsibility you are willing to take up for your life, the better and more successful you'll become. If you're poor, it's your fault. If you're lonely, it's your fault. If you're unsuccessful, it's your fault. Blaming anyone for your problem or poverty will only make you a failure in life. Stand up and take responsibility for your life. Now let's discuss. Which of the above lessons from Clinton's life makes more sense to you? What other things do you like to learn from Bill Clinton that are not mentioned in this video? Which other successful person would you like us to make a video about? Kindly drop your comment. If you like this video, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. And if you've not subscribed to our channel, subscribe now and turn on the notification because we'll help you to discover secrets of success from the world's best books and great people. We love you.